Hello, welcome. I'm Liu. Today, let's continue on talking about fractions. Today, we will talk about equal fractions and problem. Here are two squares. First, let's look at the first square. I am going to cut it in the middle like this, and I took one piece away. This is known as one second or one half. Now let's look at the second square. I am going to divide it into four equal slices like this. Now instead of taking one piece away, I am going to take two pieces away. One, two. This is known as two fourths. As you can see, these fractions are equal because they are both taking half away. So one half equals two fourth. Equal fractions mean the same amount but with different denominators and numerators. Now let's look at a few more examples. Here is a rectangle. I am going to divide it in half like this, and I took one piece away. From the last slide, we know that this is one half. Now let's look at a few more examples. Here I have the same rectangle, but I am going to divide it into six equal pieces. Now I am going to take. Three pieces away. This is known as three six. Now let's look at this example. Again, I have the same rectangle, but I am going to divide it into one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight pieces. Now I am going to take four pieces away. This is known as four eighths. Again, here I have the same rectangle, but I divided it into ten equal pieces. I took five pieces away. This is known as five tenth. So these fractions are equal because they are all taking half away. But of course, there are more equivalent fractions. I'll leave that to you to figure this out. Now let's look at a pizza problem. I have a pizza that can be cut into either eight large equal slices or twelve small equal slices. If I've already cut four large slices from the pizza, how many small slices can be cut from what remains? Here is a pizza cut in into eight large equal slices. And here is a pizza cut into twelve small equal slices. Now let's figure this out together. So here is a pizza cut into eight large equal slices. Here I have marked it by numbers. We know that four slices are half of eight slices, so the fraction is four eight. Here I have put a line in the middle. To show that four slices are half of the pizza. Now let's look at this pizza. I have divided it into twelve small equal slices. Here I have marked it by numbers. We know that six slices are half of twelve slices, so the fraction is six twelfths. Here I have put the line in the middle to show that six pieces are half of the pizza. Now let's go back to the question. We know that I have already cut it four large slices from the pizza. So how many smaller pieces can I still fit in? Let's look at this picture. So we know that we can fit in six small. Equal slices, so this half and this half make a whole. 
So the answer is six small slices can be cut from what remains. That's all for today. Did you think this was fun? I did. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye. See you later.